Hello, we're going to work out VAT with, from a gross price to find out what the VAT would be or what the net price would be. So the gross price is what you would actually pay in a shop for things like nail varnish and most general goods excluding food and um, books and children's clothes, things like that. So once we know what our gross price is or the price inclusive of VAT then we can do some simple sums to find out what the VAT would be or what the, the price without the VAT would be. Now the easiest way to explain it is when you buy something in the UK that has got 20% VAT added you're actually paying 120% for the price of something. So here I've got six 20p pieces and together they make 120. So that is the cost of the actual goods and then that is the tax that you're paying to the government. And together they make 120%. So to find the VAT we need to find out what we need to divide that by. So that's what we want to find out. Okay. And you can see there's one, two, three, four, five, six, and we want to find out one. So all we do is divide by six, and that will give us the VAT. So one point one pound and twenty pence divided by six gives you twenty pence. Likewise, if we want to find this price, what we need to do then is divide by, remember this is a whole and then this is part of a whole so this is one and then this would be 0.2 because um, it's 20% remember okay so we need to divide by 1.2 to get the net price which is the price of the goods themselves so £1.20 divided by 1.2 should give you £1 okay so that's the equations and that's how it works. So if we take this bottle of nail varnish and say it cost £4.80 in the shops and divided that by 6, this equation here, so divided by 6, that should give us 80 pence. Okay. If we divided £4.80 divided by 1.2, that should give us uh, four pounds. So the equations stay the same no matter what, as long as it's 20%. If that's not 20%, then you have to use different equations. Um, but that's the basic rules of it. So hopefully that's nice and easy rules for you to understand. So if you've got a price that has tax included and you need to divide it find the, the VAT or the, the net price then these are how you would do it so um, I'd take a screenshot or whatever but use that to help you thank you